Hey everyone, it's Miss Chang here. I'm excited to share with you one of my favorite books called The Incredible Book Eating Boy by Oliver Jeffers. Henry loved books, but not like you and I love books. No, not quite. Henry loved to eat books. It all began quite by mistake one afternoon when he wasn't paying attention. He wasn't sure at first and tried eating a single word just to test. Next, he tried a whole sentence and then the whole page. Yes, Henry definitely liked them. By Wednesday, he had eaten a whole book. And by the end of the month, he could eat a whole book in one go. Henry loved all sorts of books. Storybooks, dictionaries, atlases, joke books, books of facts, even math books. But the red ones were his favorite. And he was going through them at a fierce rate. But here is the best bit. The more he ate, the smarter he got. He read a book about a goldfish and then knew what to feed Ginger. Before long, he could do his father's crossword puzzles in the newspapers. And he was even smarter than his teacher in school. Henry loved being smart. He thought that if he kept going, he might even become the smartest person on earth. So he kept eating books and getting smarter and smarter and smarter. He went from eating books whole to eating them three or four at a time. Books about anything. Henry wasn't fussy and he wanted to know it all. But then things started going not quite so well. In fact, they were starting to go very, very wrong. Henry was eating too many books and too quickly at that. I am going to eat you. Bite, bite, chew, gulp, gulp, green, greener, Greenest, blah. He was beginning to feel a little ill. But here is the worst bit. Everything that he was learning was getting all mixed up. He didn't have time to digest it properly. It had become quite embarrassing for him to speak. Suddenly, Henry didn't feel very smart at all. More than one person had told him he should stop eating books. No more books. Your head and belly can't cope. Besides, this way no one else can enjoy them. So sadly, Henry gave up eating books and sat for a long time. What was he supposed to do? Then, after a while, and almost by accident, Henry picked up a half-eaten book from the floor. But instead of putting it in his mouth, Henry opened it up and began to read. And it was so good. Henry discovered that he loved to read, and he thought that if he read enough, he might still become the smartest person on earth. Now Henry, now Henry reads all the time. Although, every now and then, I 
guess Henry got a bite of this book. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are well. Miss you so much. See you soon.